205 front squat. It's been a while since I've done that. Felt really good. Feeling my lower back a little bit, so I'm probably gonna take it easy, but got a lot of deadlifts coming up after this, but otherwise, uh, really, really fun lift. Enjoyed that. And so we're getting ready to do, uh, it's a 15 minute AMRAP. It's, uh, I think, 10 deadlifts. Uh, uh, geez, I gotta check it out. All right, it's uh, 12 deadlifts. Wait. <laughs> All right, it's a 15 minute AMRAP. It's nine deadlifts at 155. 12 push-ups and then 15 box jumps. It's as many reps as possible in uh, 15 minutes, I believe. Um, it's tough. I'm exhausted. I've been, I've been at work all day and uh, just really kind of physically drained, sore from previous workouts. But what I really like about this is just uh, just really just chipping away at it. Just kind of one movement at a time, one rep at a time. It's just kind of a, how we you know, just deal with a lot of things really in life. We just take it one situation kind of at a time. So uh, we'll see how I do. I'm hoping to at least make four full rounds. So we'll see how it goes.
six full rounds. I'm pretty excited about that. Although I feel like I'm about to die. You know, it's just something how mental really this whole thing is because on the last round, I knew there was only 30 seconds or so left when I was on the box jumps to complete the uh, sixth round. I needed 15 box jumps. And I was able to get all 15 of those in 30 seconds. I swear the previous rounds, I probably went well over a minute to get those just mentally not able to get over that hump. But when she gave me the 30 second countdown, suddenly I wanted to hit that mark. So I sped up, you know. And it just makes me think, you know, how many of us go through life with uh, maybe some type of obstacle that we just can't overcome, whether it's spiritual or physical, you know, and there's just desire to get over it, but there's no, there's nobody with that countdown clock, you know, to really get us motivated to, to get it done. You know? That's part of the reason I just, I exercise, you know. Um, I read the Bible, I pray fast, you know, um, knowing that through discipline and obedience, that urgency, that stamina builds. Really, the stamina builds and the urgency comes when we're in tune with God and His Spirit and what He's speaking to us on a daily basis, you know. The Bible tells us in Ephesians to redeem the time because the days that we live in are evil, you know. It means move with haste, you know, with urgency because the world is perishing, you know. And I know it's God's will that none should perish, you know. So whether it's here at CrossFit or it's at my workplace or at church, you know, I continue to lift Jesus up. He said when He's lifted up, He would draw men unto Him. You know, so I just want to encourage anybody out there that's maybe struggling with an obstacle you'd like to overcome. You know, um, ask God to fill you with that urgency, that 30 second countdown. Knowing that you can get it done if you would just trust Him, believe Him, have faith, and watch miracles happen in your life. So, you can email me any questions, prayer requests. I love getting prayer requests and praying with people. Roy at Big Grace, so just comment down below. And until next time, always remember, practice what you preach.